We are coming to you live from Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena, and the A-listers are out tonight. You can feel the electricity in the air. Feel it? There's an electrical storm! Look, a boat just took out their mascot! Lightning blasts all over the place, Grim! This is dangerous! And danger is what this league is all about, Bricks, and the fans, they're loving it. Remember, in the MFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The Crux and Skull Jugulars battle the Los Scandalous Volts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Briggs, do you smell something burning? Well, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Opa! Uh-huh, it's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take your shampoo and ouzo? Stick your head in the toaster oven. That'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. First and ten. If they don't hear it coming, it'll not Oh, ah, shit, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. First and ten. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! Second down and ten. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Briggs. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. First down. First and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked up the ball on that one. Second 
Second down and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third and two. And the defense was reading him like a book. And he punched his way out of that tackle. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Second down, and, he, and the defense goes for the juggler and rushes to kill the quarterback. And look at the QB run for his life. He's so fast. Nah, he just found out about that cheerleader's pregnancy test. I'd run, too. She's huge. Second down and two. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in fantasy. Third and two. First and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and two. Two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Hey, man, I was here on the now. You know what Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. needs a miracle. He was starting to go some
Jim Arbity gets stomped after three. They usually stomp me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. He is fighting for every yard. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Third down in. The punter is warming up. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty... Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. Now I'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking, and he don't make much sense. Nobody's making a lot of dollars. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. <laughs> now here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that... Uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. Nice cap, and he turns on the afterburner. Put returners in. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. Oh. And this guy is on fuego. Does he like his original or extra crispy? <laughs> By the looks of it, extra crispy. down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. First and four. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third and 
four. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and three. Dropped the interception. And it's why he's a defense, schmuck. And they'll line up for the punt here. <laughs> nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. They called a zap attack. The ball carrier better move his ass. Oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. First and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And that'll be second and eight to go. Should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And he breaks away. Quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the refs some cash. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, and the quarterback throws. 
threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. They stump the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. It's them against the other team and the clock. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just give him the pay. You kill a ref. It's not murder if they have it coming, right? Take the hit. Do something about that ref, you pussies. I won't even get out of Second down, and we've got a pick. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Just burn the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible, though. Just gotta scrape off the charred parts. And he throws that one to the sidelines. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show, sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. Boy, these guys are going to need to pull off a huge comeback in the second half to win this game. Here comes the kickoff. Grab the toast! Why do we even come back and bother? This is a waste of our time! Yeah, if only one team is going to show up, why should we have to? The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe for the headache. Third down and six. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Boom! First and ten. Oh, 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 oh. Damn, this a bomb kill right in someone's face. This is your first time playing the game? Hey, you with the controller in the hand. I'm talking to you. Second down and ten. And the defense jumps on side. And the whistle blows the play dead along with the quarterback.
And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. First down and six. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, man, he would. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nice how may not kill him yet. He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's shipping layers of smarmy grin. Second down and a mile. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not gonna take it anymore. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Third down and forever. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change his card, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Third down and five. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a matter in lost wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose, don't you think? He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Wow, this is just horrible to watch. It looks like he's malfunctioning. Someone help him. He's just dancing, Bricks. Still probably better than I could. <laughs> Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy. But Bricks can't even get one. Oh. He caught it. That's two points and even more momentum on their side. I can feel the momentum shifting. For the last time, you're not a Jedi, Bricks. <laughs> Now 
The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. That pass play nets them seven yards. Ah, uh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get, get rid of them again? You stick your head in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop them. Pressure right there, folks. And it's first and ten. to make this one interesting. Third down, the offense needs a miracle. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. point attempt. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring.
First down and one. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's on those power and green like a high school. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Second down and long. He had it for a second there. Well, good luck. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. And it's first and ten. Sandwich. And that'll bring up second and one. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. Oh, nice hit! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. in the past, but I had the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a... The defense calls the first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait. What, you're married? Uh, it's complicated. <laughs> and that's two timeouts gone for the defense. But they've really got to get the ball back to their offense. But the offense is like 30 balls over there on the sideline just waiting for them. Why don't they just use them? Ask the ball boy. He didn't do nothing. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. The defense just used their last time out, and there's still plenty of game left to play. Oh, congratulations! You just played yourself! Memes won't make you cool, Bricks, no matter what your mom says. He is automatic! Nice kick! Boring. Just give him the points, and let's move on. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Don't worry. If he shots it again, they... Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 10. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scored! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. The Bolts electrify the opposition and come away with a victory. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, did I ever tell well, let's you... Let's listen to MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say.
Seriously, man, you think you'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not